hill. Can let the chickens into no chicken land. Oh yeah. Honey found it. Ginger found it. Boo, you want to come around the fence? Hmm? I gotta have some little buggies in there or something. And Sissy and Twisted, they're both sitting in the boxes, being broody. They'll quit eventually. Ooh, Ginger found something good. Little tomato plants. I don't think anybody's very hungry. She did like the little cabbage that was coming up. Yep, Ginger picks a good one. June 22nd, and the carrots have come up. Boy, that hasn't happened in years. I did something right for a change. I know it's kind of late in the year to start them, but they're up. Here's the other two tomatoes from Never Enough Dirt. Oh, looks like the top of that one got broken. Let's see, it's a moist ground moist. It's still moist. Hooray! I have been watering it. I think I better check on the roses. I haven't looked at them since I did the pineapple update. And you are dying down. But no potatoes. You're looking better, but you're younger. Leaf has fallen off. Don't think it's going to make it. Oh, darn. I had a good tin cilantro coming up. I'm down to one. Were these chewed off, or did they just fall over from the heat? Uh, they just fell over from all the heat. Permaculture beds doesn't mean anything in Southern California. It is just too hot. And this is too young of a bed. Even though I water twice a day, usually. And of course, yesterday I only watered in the morning, and it got up to 88. And <laughs> no more cilantro. I have tried growing it I don't know how many times. And I was going to let it all go to seed so I can reseed itself on a regular basis. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Looks like I need to get out here and pick the dried lima beans. There's a whole section of them there. Because I wonder if that's what's killing the plant back. Well, yeah, I think they're only supposed to live for one season anyway, so... What am I bitching about? Oh, let's see if something chews those off. The other day I called them cucumbers. They're cantaloupes, they're cantaloupes, and I have two. Put down two different packages. A couple did come up and got chewed off. So I bet you these get chewed off too. My flower bed. Dandelions or poppies? I'd say dandelions. Poppies don't look like that. But the leaves can look like that. So I don't want to pull them out until I'm sure. Because there's three or four of them in there. And there's the red sunflowers. Mexican red sunflowers. Oh, what are you doing? Are you being a poppy? I would say definitely dandelion. What's your verdict? Put your answer down below. Let me know if you think all these little guys are going to be poppies or dandelions. Oh, they can go in my tea bucket. Well, up to now, the birdies have left the strawberries alone. And those are birdies because it's little V's. Oh dear. I do have netting. I used to put it up.
but nothing was affected this year, so I didn't put it up. Man, all the birdies must be starving. A bit of an aphid update. They're disappearing. It's got to be that stinky tea. Oh, I have a little strawberry over here. Bet you that, bet you that's come up from seed. But that's the only piece with aphids left on it. Look at those pretty little faces. Something going across the street. Something's going on. It's only ten thirty at night. up there. Hmm, wonder what they're doing. They've disappeared. Car. No truck. Car. Everybody loves turning around here. It's still over there, whatever it is. It has something sparkly. They sure stagger around a lot. Oh, looks like somebody's out walking their dog and pooping in everybody's yard. dog doesn't want to cooperate. It looks like the dog's walking the guy, not the guy walking the dog. No, oh, go where the dog wants to go. Glad it's not a fast dog, because it doesn't look like the guy can't move that fast. <laughs> well-trained dog. Yeah, come over here. It smells like raccoons. All the dogs have to come and smell. People can't understand why. I 
check your phone. Yep, yeah, nothing better to do. Nope, dog's going that way now. <laughs> oh, this is funny. It's better than regular TV. Just going to stand there all night? Dog ain't doing nothing. This has been an interesting night. I wonder if that's the guy that was staggering across the yard earlier. Come on, let's do something. He's shining the light over here for trying to see the camera. Dog's freaking out for some reason. Yeah, let's drag the dog this way. <laughs> <laughs> 